Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, I'm greatly thankful for the support in this House for the delegation which I led of Liberal International to Managua. We came in peace on invitation of a parliamentary majority to speak out about the Constitution, to speak about re-election and the election campaign and human rights and civil liberties. We were cursed, we were pirates and those things. We were threatened to be expelled out of the country, threatened to be persona non grata and it was said that we were staging a golpe, a coup d'etat. But more important than that, they cursed my country and they oppressed their own people. And I think that the European Union should monitor what happens in Nicaragua, should send uh, observers to the election in 2011 and support the democratic opposition. I also hope that we will do in the end the same and we be objective in the result of the election in Honduras. Let us see whether the elections on Sunday are free and fair and let's make a decision then. It could be that if we recognize the result of the elections, it will be an end to the constitutional crisis in that country. I thank you very much, Mr. President.